Hello everyone. Counseling is a very important step while you are willing to get admission in your dream medical college. Today I'll be talking about the Kerala State Medical Counseling Procedure and yes, we'll be talking about the seat matrix, cutoff analysis and the entire process. The one thing is very important that official website. The official website where you need to go for registration and all other processes and the website is cee.kerala.gov.in. Now, the question comes what is the eligibility criteria to get admission in the medical colleges of the Kerala state? So very first thing, candidate must have nativity or the domicile certificate of the Kerala state or candidate must have passed A to 12th class from the Kerala state. Simultaneously, one more condition is also there that from Kerala state or he or she must have been a resident of Kerala state for a period of 5 years within the period of 12 years of his or her study. So eligibility criteria is very very clear here. Now the turn comes for the entire process. So very first thing and uh, the different thing is that for Kerala state you have to register early. For the early online registration procedure you need to go to the official website which is cee.kerala.gov.in and there you need to register yourself. Post NEET results, the publication of state rank would be done by the state committee. The turn comes for to choose the preferences. The colleges of your preference you need to fill there in the procedure of online choice filling. On the basis of your state rank and the preferred choices, a seat would be allocated to you and you need to report to the allotted institution as per the provided guidelines. Now the question comes how to check the seats available nearby. You can have a look on the map given there on the screen. You can just check what are the medical college which are there in your own city or in the nearby cities. So in the map it's been clearly mentioned. You can have a look on it. Further. When it comes to the seat metrics to understand for MBBS, the total number of colleges in the Kerala states are 31 and the total number of seats are 4,155 out of which 12 government medical colleges are there which contain 1,755 seats. But when it comes to the private medical colleges for MBBS, these are 19 with the 2,400 seats. Here. It's very important to look at the medical colleges which are given there on the screen. These are the government medical colleges where I just mentioned the total number of seats as well. By just looking at that, you would have an idea that how to fill the choices of your preferences. Now, same ways you can have a look on the private medical colleges of your own city or nearby cities, right? The total number of seats are also available on the screen. Then the turn comes to have a look on the BDS seat matrix as well. The map given on the screen will give you an idea about the colleges there in your city as well as the colleges which are there in the neighboring city as well. Total number of the BDS medical colleges are 25 in the Kerala state and there the 1920 seats are available. Here out of 25 BDS colleges, 6 are the government colleges and 19 are the private or the self-finance institution. Now seat bifurcation is very important. So here the 300 government seats are available for BDS and 1620 seats are there as the self-finance institution. Now again have a look on the government dental colleges along with their provided seats and private dental colleges as well. You can clearly have an idea about the number of seats available in the respective colleges by just looking at the screen. So seat metrics we have discussed and the turn comes for Kerala State Medical Counseling Chart. What this chart is? It includes a two important segment. The first segment is Government Medical Colleges and the second segment is Self Finance Institution. Here in the Government Medical Colleges, I've mentioned 85% seat. What does it mean? It means the 15% seats have already been counted for all India quota or those seats would be considered in all India counselling. Now, among these 85% seats, you should understand that how the seats have been bifurcated. So I'm just going to tell you about 
the various bifurcation so 85 percent is considered as the complete 100 percent and out of that 50 percent is there at the state merit then ews economical weaker section would have 10 percent and then sebc that consists of 30 percent right so it includes izawa ez that is nine percent muslim or mu eight percent further other backward hindu bh that is of three percent latin catholic and anglo indian la this is three percent once again and uh, dhirwara and related communities indicated by dv two percent it is vishwakarma and related communities indicated by vk two percent kusavan and related communities k this is one percent other backward christians bx one percent and kudumbi that is ku one percent so these acronyms are mentioned here just to represent these categories further sc and st categories include 10 percent when it comes to self-finance institutions or the private medical colleges so 100 percent seats have been filled by state counseling only right now here further bifurcation is also there so community seats up to 50 percent maximum nri seats 15 percent quota all india quota or am this is 15 percent remaining seats are filled as per the reservation norms so this is the entire counseling chart and it's pretty important to understand the list of documents which you need to present at the time of counseling so one thing is academic eligibility mark sheet or the certificate neat ug admit card and the mark sheet that you need to present domicile nativity certificate if applicable category certificate for ews sebc sc or st simultaneously ph certificate is also needed if you are belonging to the same category passport size photograph is needed government id proof is needed and certificate to prove your date of birth that is also very very important here one thing i just want to mention that other state student can also participate in kerala state medical counseling procedure under all india quota 15 percent in private medical colleges only now it's important to understand that what is the cutoff which is needed what is the rank which is needed to get admission right so the reference that i'm using here is the government medical college cutoff of year 2022 till the round two right have a look on it if i'm talking about the sm category that includes the rank that is 12486 and the marks were 620 now when it comes to mu muslim category 18149 is the rank and the marks are 606 further dhirwara and related communities if we talk about the rank is 86740 and the cutoff marks 496 for kudumbi category ku 183081 is the rank and the marks 396 same ways for st category it is 366764 this was the rank and the marks were 275 same ways ews the rank was 55037 marks were 541 same ways for backward hindu category 31258 this was the rank and the marks were 580 for vk category vk category is vishwakarma and related communities there the rank is 35821 and the marks 571 for kn category kusavan and related communities the rank was 178497 and the marks were 400 same ways for ez category that is izawa category 26102 was the rank and the marks 589 la category which is latin catholic and anglo indian for the same we have 46,693, that's the rank and the cutoff marks 553. Further for BX category, that is other backward Christian, rank is 45,638 and the marks were 555. Same ways for SC category, the rank was 172,657 and the cutoff marks were 405. So this is basically based on the cutoff of year 2022 round two counseling. This will give you an idea about the cutoff. Now turn comes for 
the same discussion for the private medical colleges so here the chart is clearly visible and for the various category rank and the cut off marks are clearly visible right now turn comes for the same discussion for the government dental colleges as well so if you are willing to go for the counseling process of the government dental colleges then also you need to look at the rank and the cut off marks have a look on it category wise it is clearly being mentioned while taking admission scholarship plays an important role so there are two type of scholarships available one is keam bpl scholarship and srk pratiksha trust these are the two type of scholarship and to know more about the eligibility and the selection process you have to visit the official websites which are given there on the board one thing is very important to note here that there is no fees for sc st and oec candidates sc and st can study even at private colleges in the government fees and the same thing is also applicable for oec they can also study in the government fees right now it's important to understand about the liquidated damages these are basically the discontinuation bond government or the self financing medical or the dental colleges we are talking about for government seats only for mbbs course 10 lakh is the discontinuation bond and for the bds course it is of 5 lakh so this is the entire discussion of the kerala state medical counseling process and i hope this video is going to help you if you are willing to get admission in the kerala state medical college this video will give you an idea and along with that you can even share this video with your friends or the relative further all the very best for your preparation and the admission procedure thank you so much